Did you try to connect your Renogy solar suitcase to your RV using the solar ready or solar on the side connector and see a B01 error message or it just won't charge? We had the same problem. So here are two ways to solve the problem in a few minutes. Plus, if you try this out and you have a Lance brand travel trailer, stay tuned at the end for another fix that you may need in addition to these steps. So first, here's our Renogy solar suitcase. This is a 100 watt, 12 volt, off-grid portable solar kit. It has a built-in kickstand, so you can easily position it however you need to maximize sun exposure. It's waterproof and comes with its own 20 amp charge controller. This is a great solar kit. It's the one we use. There's a link in the description if you want to get it. Next, here is the solar on the side plug for our Lance travel trailer. In order to plug in the Renogy solar suitcase to the solar on the side plug on your trailer, you'll need an adapter. This adapter is called an MC4 to SAE adapter. If, like me, you may already have one of these, or maybe one shipped with your Renogy solar suitcase, you don't need to buy a new one. However, even if you already have one of these, you'll still get the same B01 error message. The B01 error message, which sometimes looks like 601, means no battery connected. Why? Well, the company that provides the solar on the side adapter would really prefer for you to buy their solar equipment, and so they made their connectors work for their own equipment. But maybe you already have your own solar panels, or maybe you want a really high quality, durable unit like the Renogy solar suitcase. No problem. Here are two super easy ways to solve this problem. Option one, you can buy a reverse polarity SAE adapter. These guys are between five and $15 on Amazon, and you just plug them into your solar on the side before you plug in your panels. Honestly, this is the easiest solution, but not so useful if you're already camping. Option two, if you don't want to buy anything else, in three steps, you can quickly reverse the polarity of the wires connected to your solar on the side plug. Here's how to do this. First, open up the wiring panel and find the wires coming from the solar on the side connection. Second, cut the wires and strip off the ends. Third, connect the red to black and black to red wires. I really like using these electrical wire connector screw terminals, but you can just use electrical tape. Fourth, close up your panel. That's it. Now you can connect your Renogy solar suitcase panels directly to your trailer using the solar on the side connection. And that pesky B01 error is gone and now showing that your Renogy solar panels are charging your battery. Okay, now if you have a Lance travel trailer, if your Renogy shows the same error message after you reverse the polarity, here may be an extra step. The Lance has two fuses on the other side of the travel trailer behind another body panel. It may be that while switching the polarity of the solar on the side, you accidentally blew one of these fuses. Here's how to check and replace it. Go to the other side of your Lance travel trailer and open the panel just inside the storage bay underneath the battery. There are likely to be two fuses, a 30 amp and a 15 amp fuse. You open them by sliding the red cap off of the fuse protector. Check the fuse. If it's blown, you'll need to replace the fuse with an equivalent amp fuse. The fuses are inexpensive. There's a link in the description to the fuse kit we keep in our travel trailer, but hopefully you'll have a spare that you can use. Hey, thanks for watching. If you liked that video, be sure to like it. Travel smart, live better.